Imagine you're brushing your teeth in the morning. Dio stops time, comes in there, takes your toothbrush, starts wiping his ass with it, puts it back in your mouth, and then runs away. You get done brushing your teeth and go, why my breath still stink? Dio is the only villain that can go into a yapping session, and I fully listen to it. Bro either says something really cocky, he starts glazing himself, or he just comes up with a really good analogy. Bro has blood gushing out of his throat. He's still able to talk. How? How? I don't know. I killed your man's Jotaro. Are you going to get it back in blood? Your grandpa started yapping about he can stop time. So I turned into Playboy Cardi. He can stop breathing. But this is why Jotaro used to be my favorite anime character. I have to move closer if I want to beat your sorry ass to a pulp. Dio was like, didn't your granddaddy tell you not to throw hands with me? Well, my hands are diamond tested. Let's see if your hands is really like that. Rewatching this fight makes me realize this anime looks so damn goofy. Throughout this whole show i've never seen you fly not once bro so we just flying now well actually god of flashness they're not actually flying they're actually stand jumping that's what makes it look like they're flying if you wipe the jojo glaze off your glasses does this look like a jump to you does it dio has to be one of the greatest haters of all time better than zoro and black people better than reverse flash and flash remember when you were making out with your first girlfriend and you came right as she touched your leg it was me, Parry. I jerked you off at super speed so it'd seem like you nutted at just a woman's touch. Actually, I take that last one back. I like how blood just gushed out of Bro's face after he just got smacked. And then Jojo just staring at him like, ah, she got right. Ain't all that. I ain't too impressed. Only in Jojo would somebody see a finger twitch and they start having a 30 second analysis of it. I've never seen anybody glaze themselves as much as Dio does. I bet if he could clone himself, I think he would try to blow his own back out. My mans can't even fly straight. The outfit was already bad enough. Everyone knows you're supposed to lay on your tummy when you fly. Why are you laying on your back? These gay allegations are getting harder and harder to defend you from. So then Dio finally realizes, he goes, hey, he can't move in my time stop. So then he goes for the finishing blow. But little did Dio know, Jotaro just signed him up for the donut membership card. It caught Dio so off guard, bro, started having a time stop midlife crisis. So Dio starts spazzing out on this frightened lady like she was the one that knocked him through the window. Fetch me my leg, woman. Are you deaf? Grab my leg. So he sucks her dry and he's able to heal his wounds and also his clothes and this is why Dio is like that this is why Dio is really the best this is why Dio is a peak villain oh no the glazing is contagious just like Jotaro being able to fly these knives come completely out of nowhere where did he get these knives I know Jotaro was in his head like bro you pulling out more knives you doing too much so I'm thinking there's no way he can come back from this this man starts lifting up his hat and his clothes and goes good thing I put those books under there in case those knives ever came at me when did you have the time to stop by barnes and noble so dio goes yeah i know i stabbed you with like a hundred dives but i need to make sure you dead so let me chop off your head jotaro starts sweating bullets this might be one of the only moments i was proud of ponerith when i first watched part three i'm like damn bro kind of like soccer of the group so big surprise he doesn't kill dio so he has to get saved and jotaro has to end up making noise to make dio feel like he's still alive shoot him but sir he's not black i said Shut up. So Jotaro is just playing dead, waiting for him to pull up. He's like, once he pulls up, I'm going to beat the shit out of him. Hey, you know what they say? Go to anime characters, know how to stop their hearts. That's what they saying. Why Dio always posing like an Instagram thought? Felt cute, might delete later. With that much brain damage, Dio, you might have to start riding a short bus with Sakura too. Bro's legs is trembling harder than me in Thailand after a long night with the lady boys. Now this is one of the funniest scenes I've ever seen in anime. Bro just thought he made a clean getaway. Guess what? And where do you think you're going? How did he get there so fast? I guess we'll never know. Uh-oh. I know what this music means. This is how it feels whenever I watch Jotaro beat the shit out of somebody. <laughs> But damn, don't you hate it when you beat up the main villain and then send their bodies flying? Directly to like your grandpa so that he can get a power boost and then y'all have to go round two for another fight? Ah, uh, I hate when that happens. With more power, bro looks more zesty. Where did he get the lipstick from? So Joseph tries to give Jotaro a pep talk and it goes something like, If you let someone make you mad, then they become your master. Be in control. Flow like water. But then Dio just ruins all that and starts slurping on Joseph like a Goku pack. I suck to me. 
dry. What do you mean by that? Y'all are too damn swole to be running around in this anime. I'd much rather prefer you flying. Have you ever seen somebody run as a bodybuilder? Now you understand how I feel. He really just stopped time just to be dramatic before he kills him. These videos literally have the exact same vibe to them. This is one of the most iconic moments in anime. Better than Goku and Frieza. Better than Naruto and Sasuke. All 48 episodes led up to this very moment. I'm out. I'm not watching this. Look. You're telling me you flew around for nine seconds and you looked at a gun, you was like, nah. You looked at a gasoline truck that could probably explode on impact, you was like, nah. There's no way you thought this was the best option. So they start seeing who could punch the truck the hardest, I guess. And then Jotaro stops punching it and then Neo thinks he won. A second doesn't even go by. His first thought is, you know what? I gotta start glazing myself again, bro. Bro stands there for almost a minute just glazing. But then suddenly time stops and all you hear behind him is, this is for the dead homies. Earlier you said my diamond tester was fake. Now we about to see who diamonds can break or whose diamonds are unbreakable. So he breaks his legs and then says him flying and Dio sitting on the floor like, how did this happen? Impossible. Am I fumbling the bag? Bro, you had five times to end the fight by now. Just accept your L. Even while his legs are broken, bro's still trying to scheme. Yeah, keep yapping. How you like my blood in your eye? Now, typically you can tell if something works just by looking at the anime character's face and um he looks pretty young face so i already knew what was about to happen 